The People's Liberation Army, the PLA, marks its 95th anniversary this year. But what exactly is the PLA? Here's the backstory. Ninety-five years ago, the forerunner to the PLA was founded by the Communist Party of China, the CPC, in 1927. Originally called the Chinese Workers and Peasants Red Army, it has played an important role in the country's journey. In September 1931, Japan invaded northeastern China. From October 1934 to October 1936, the Red Army trekked 12,500 kilometers across the country breaking the siege of the Kuomintang forces and continued to fight the Japanese aggressors. On July 7, 1937, Japan launched a full-scale invasion of China. During the anti-Japanese war, under the command of the CPC, the 8th Route Army, the new 4th Army and other anti-Japanese armed forces penetrated deep behind enemy lines to mobilize the masses. China's resistance against Japanese aggression was one of the most heroic chapters of the world anti-fascist war. During China's War of Liberation from 1945 to 1949, the PLA defeated the far superior Kuomintang troops, who were equipped by the US. The victory led to the founding of the People's Republic of China, the PRC, in October 1949. After the founding of the PRC, the PLA undertook tasks of national defense, while also taking a role in bolstering the socialist revolution and construction and at the same time sought to make the army more revolutionary, modernized, and regularized. The PLA protects China and its people, as well as making significant contributions to safeguarding world peace via the United Nations. On the 95th anniversary of the founding of the PLA, the army aims to keep marching forward towards its goal of being fully transformed into a world-class force by the mid-21st century.